ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another adventure with Denim Dave. Today, we're heading out to Ritzville, Washington for a backcountry camping trip with our friends, the Kleinsmiths. Michael's gonna be in the truck with me, bringing his ATV, my ATV, all the camping gear we need. We're gonna hit the road. Let's get to it. You got me in the studio today because my video corrupted and, well, without me telling you what's happening, you might never know. So we're gonna cut to it, get on the road. You all ready? Oh, yeah. Put her in reverse. Hopefully we don't lose an ATV on the freeway somewhere. I don't think that hit track is fine. Let's see, I'm not sure. No. <laughs> Someone's gonna be very upset if it breaks off. <laughs> I feel like more than one people, more than one person will be upset. It'll be funny. like you and your parents. <laughs> because it's that. <theirs. laughs> yeah. Anyways, hopefully safe travels. This is one of those trips where the agenda is to just have fun and stay safe. I'm super excited because we got all the people we need to have a blast. All the camping gear we have, we need in order to do this right, and all the equipment to have a heck of a lot of fun. What is this guy doing? Alright, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need this little boy right here because we got some work to do. Uh oh, oh wow. <laughs> Can I get my gloves? <laughs> Do you feed in the steers? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna get my coat on, drive up the house, and then... Yeah, you can... What's the plan for going up the campsite? Go up and get Ben to work. Okay, I'll do that. Hey, buddy, hi. Hey, Marie, how's it going? You get heading out to feed the cows? Nice. Oh, milk them? Okay, I'll go find them. I'd rather you carry it than me. Ooh, that was close. Just when we thought we could leave, Matthew left the key on. What? <laughs> what? What? I'm sure you guys can relate to us today. It's one of those days when you go to start your vehicle and all you get is the tick, tick, tick. Well, it's not a problem because we got a Ford to rescue a Chevy. Go Ford, baby. We got the shovels loaded up. Hay bales for the insulation underneath the tarp in the tent. The wood for the wood heat. We're going to be living like kings out there. I don't even know if this is called camping, but I know we're about to be on the road in three, two, one. Oh, Michael is going so fast. I know you rolled this, the sled and lost everything you had in it. Nothing happened. <laughs> nothing at all, right? Nope, nothing. <laughs> but we're all back together, looking good. Bree's superintendent on this project. Boss lady with their uh, little pipe right there. Oh yeah, oh yeah. What do we have, another mile or so and then we're gonna have camp? Yeah, about. Uh, right, go out uh, straight out a mile, over a mile, back in to those rocks a mile. Dude, this is so pretty. Last year we were out here there was no snow. I know. This is so much better. <laughs> Keep it moving. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> Oh, 
Welcome to the secret entrance to Camp 12 Mile. Just up ahead and around the corner is... What? Well, I was gonna say around the corner, but without the flow, we can't even get around the corner. We'll just throw it back up there. I'm sure it'll make it. Just around the corner up here is one of the favorite camping spots ever. Welcome to Camp 12 Mile. Nestled in this beautiful little ravine, this is the perfect spot for a couple day vacation. <laughs> if you can even get there with your load. Anyway, it looks like the ATVs made it. We're gonna get to setting up camp, and that's gotta start with a fire. Oh my. <laughs> nice. Oh, you lost one. Oh! I don't know, you're scared a little bit. Nice. Ow, my head. Poor head. Don't back. What are you doing? Don't take all of it. Wait, 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 what are you doing? Oh. Um, yeah, that is right. Go for it. Go, go, go. You guys come back and there's like nothing else done. All we've been doing is racing around on ATVs. <laughs> now, I do not expect that of you, but if certain people were here, <laughs> I would expect that. Who are the certain people? <laughs> you know. Not gonna name and you know. <laughs> so, we just got this small cook, this cook tent set up, and you can see the list of the people who have used these in the past. This one goes back to 85. There's some that have faded. You can't see anymore, but it uh, goes back to 1985. And before the end of this trip, we'll make sure to put our names on there. Yay! Yeah, yeah. What do you want us to do? Make the wind blow that way. <laughs> That'd be nice. So I can sit there. Yeah. Right here. <laughs> I got you, Ben. Beautiful. Things are looking really good around here. We've got everything mostly set up, but there's a few major things left to do. We got a rain fly to put on the top, a fire to make in the stove, a floor to put down in the tent, dinner to make, and we still got animal chores back at the ranch. So a couple of the guys are gonna head back here in a few minutes, leaving us to get started at camp, making a fire and getting dinner going. So we got our nice pile of firewood in storage. It's uh, nice and far out of the way of the fire, as per your instruction. Yep. Yeah. Now, uh, whenever we need more firewood, all we have to do is just roll it over about five inches. Two inches. Two inches. Yes. Although, oh no. Dude, our pile, it's catching on fire. Oh, no. oh we need a fire extinguisher right now. Ben, come pee on it. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, it's on fire! Help! Okay, <laughs> hey, I found it. Oh, you actually it quit. 
<laughs> Cut. Are you staying here or heading out? I'm leaving. Okay, when are you coming back? Uh, 15 minutes. No way. <laughs> There's no way you're coming back in 15 minutes. Why not? Because you're like 20 minutes from the house. Alright, uh, <laughs> two hours. Two hours? Ah! Okay. I gotta take a nap. What food are we cooking for dinner? Look around. Cool. Just whatever we can? Yeah. Cool. Make a make a goulash. Cool. What do we have for cooking utensils? Whittle yourself out a little spatula. Oh, that's tradition, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's go do this in the terrain. I like it. Terrain it is. It's starting to get dark, so we decided to head back down, get some food cooking. The other guys are gonna be back shortly and they're gonna be hungry. So we're gonna leave these ATVs up here and get to it. Got the good old food cooking. Oh yeah. Got a rain fly put on the tent. And now we got a nice foyer out front. Got the ATVs parked up there on the bluff. They look so evil parked up like that. About to fall off. Tent is looking good. We got a nice thick layer of straw for insulation. The tarp to keep us clean. Got a fire. Dude, what do you think it is? Like 75 or 80 in here? Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> It's safe to eat. Yeah. That Michael's like, um, some more, please? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's like, can you please stop shining the light in my eye? <laughs> Just like, trying to enjoy my food. Guys. There is something very wrong with this. What? Then it goes the other way. It ain't fit. It goes the other way. Gotta go the other way. It goes the other way. What Michael, goes the other way? Michael, you lie? I didn't know. This whole thing is but flipped up. All of our yes. hard work goes down the, the wick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. So, one of the things we've been doing today is cut sawing logs and build all sorts of things.
stocked and bellies full of food, we all turned into our sleeping bags for some good story time with Ben. Returning from an ice fishing trip a few years ago, I got caught in a blizzard at the top of a mountain pass. As I crept along through the blinding swirls of snow, a panel truck passed me. I decided to follow it, on the assumption that the driver obviously knew where the road was. Presently, the driver smashed into a road divider, thereby ruining my perfectly good assumption. Not to mention his truck. The truck bounced ten feet into the air and plopped back to the road. This was the kind of emergency for which years of experience had prepared me. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a wrap on the first video of the Klein Smith's camping trip. I'm really excited for this next video. It's an acre of ice with ATVs. You know, almost sank an ATV, so it's going to be a really fun video. We'll catch you in the next one, but for now, thanks for watching Denim Dave. Peace.